Instead of packed tables with plates of mouth-watering food, it's puddles and soggy seats. But inside Pacifico... We got the permit Monday, and we set up the table last night. Owner Mo Gad, who also owns Villa Lulu two doors down, knows as soon as the sun comes out, so too will the customers. On a hot day and an 80 degree, people would like to sit outside. And uh, I like it myself for having business outside. My staff like it. And that's good for business. And with spring in full swing, New Haven's outdoor dining season is officially back with restaurants turning sidewalks and parking spaces into additional revenue. The popular option to eat al fresco took off during the pandemic, with the city looking for ways to support local businesses by increasing dining options, and it's only expanded. It's just incredible how many businesses are taking us up on this opportunity. Mayor Justin Elliker says 43 restaurants have already been approved are in the process of getting their permits signed off. The season runs through the fall with a separate permit for those wanting to stay open during the winter. We have a lot of small businesses and it gives them an opportunity to add a lot more tables, a lot more customers that they can serve. And he says it's also important to the city, from the outdoor dining to the popular night market that will take over Orange Street and the Ninth Square neighborhood Friday night with dozens of vendors. When you walk down the street, there's all these people having a great time out on the sidewalk, you know, maybe having a drink after work or having dinner uh, with a loved one. And so that creates an atmosphere outside that's really lively and welcoming. Something Gad agrees with. Having a lot of people outside, uh, we get regular customer, we get walking customer, we get visitor. And what we create downtown, it did improve New Haven and did improve downtown New Haven. And uh, what I'm saying is always good for our business.